Hello friends, welcome to JavaScript video tutorials series. From the past few video tutorials, we are trying to understand working with regular expressions in JavaScript. We understood what is REGEXP object, application of regular expressions. We understood how to define a variable of type regular expression. We understood various regular expression methods like test method and exec method. Then we understood using flags with regular expressions, using meta characters with regular expressions, using begins with and ends with meta characters with regular expressions, using quantifiers with regular expressions, using expressions with regular expressions. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss validating phone number using regular expression. We understand how to validate the given phone number using regular expression guys. Before we proceed, I suggest you people to watch the previous video tutorials so that you can understand this tutorial easily guys. I minimize all the word documents. Here I have default.html page. I right click on it, say open with notepad. You can see that default.html is open in the notepad. It has basic HTML5 document structure code written. Title is set to default page. Here in the body section, I have written script tag. I minimize it. I right click on default.html page, say open with Google Chrome. You can see that default.html page is open in the Chrome. Title is set to default page. Title is set to default page. Here inside the script tag, I say document.write bracket bracket semicolon. And then I write a regular expression to validate the phone number. Indian phone numbers begin with either the digit 6, 7, 8 or 9 guys. 6, 7, 8 or 9. To indicate that, I use a caret symbol caret symbol indicates begins with which we have already discussed we have already discussed the caret symbol indicates begins with after that i use pair of square brackets pair of square brackets used to find the occurrence of one of the character guys used to find the occurrence of one of the character that we mentioned inside the pair of square brackets like i can say here 6 7 8 9 understanding so it indicates the first digit should be either 6, 7, 8 or 9. Instead of writing like this, I can also use the dash. Dash indicates in between. It is used to mention the range 6 to 9. Dash means 2, 6 to 9. So what we are telling here, we are telling the given phone number should begin with either 6 or 7 or 8 or 9. After that, we should have 9 digits, exactly 9 digits. Backward slash D indicates digit guys, which we have already discussed here. Backward slash D indicates a digit 0 to 9. And then in between pair of flower brackets, I mention 9. The pair of flower brackets indicates exactly 9 digits we should have. Okay. And then I mention dollar. Dollar indicates ends with. So this is a simple regular expression for validating the Indian phone numbers. So what we are telling here by writing this regular expression, we are telling the given phone number should begin with either 6, 7, 8 or 9. After that, we must and should have 9 digits. Then it is considered as a valid phone number, otherwise not. On this regular expression, I am going to call the test method guys. We have already discussed about the test method. Test method is used to test is there a match or no match between the regular expression and the given string. If there is a match, then it returns true, otherwise it returns false. Test method is used to test is there a match or no match between the regular expression and the given string. Here, I am going to give a phone number as a string guys. In double quotations, I say 9876543211 and 0. So this is a valid phone number guys. We will definitely get here true. Why we get true? Because using this regular expression, I am telling the given phone number should begin with either 6, 7, 8 or 9. It is starting with 9. After that, we should have 9 digits. Of course, we have here total 9 digits. You can see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, there is a match between the regular expression and the given phone number. We get true. File, save, go to browser and refresh. See, we got true. I go back and then I say here document.write. I'm adding a line break here. I use a BR tag. I copy this code and 
paste down. I replace the 9 with 8. Is it is a valid phone number? Of course, it is a valid phone number. We get true. Why? Because using this regular expression, I am telling the given phone number should begin with should begin with either 6, 7, 8 or 9. It is starting with 8 and then we should have 9 digits. Of course, we have 9 digits. So, we will get true. File, save, go to browser and refresh. I go back, I copy this code and paste down. I replace 8 with 7. Now also we get true. File, save, go to browser and refresh. I go back, I copy this code and paste down. I change this to 6. Definitely we get true. File, save, go to browser and refresh. We get true. So, if the first digit is either 6 or 7 or 8 or 9 and then after that if we have 9 digits definitely it is a valid phone number guys when do we get false okay i copy this and paste down let's say if i say here 5 now we get false why we get false because using this regular expression i am telling the given phone number should start with either 6 7 8 or 9 it is starting with 5 so definitely it is not a valid phone number we will get false guys i say file save go to browser and refresh see we got false I go back, I copy this code and paste down. Let's say by mistake I have entered A here. Now also we get false. I say file, save, go to browser and refresh. We get false because the first digit should be either 6, 7, 8 or 9 guys. After that we should have 9 digits. Let me copy this code and paste down. If I say here 9, this is a valid phone number. Definitely we get true here. I say file, save, go to browser and refresh. See, we are getting true. If I add one extra digit, I say for example 7. Now we get false. Now we get false because we must and should have 10 digits in the phone number, right? Here we have actually 11 digits. You can see we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 digits. Definitely we get false. Of course, it is starting with 9, which is valid. After that, we should have 9 digits. Actually, after the 9, we have 10 digits. So, we get false. File, save, go to browser and refresh. See, we got false. I go back. I copy this code and paste down. If we have, after the first digit, less than 9 digits, then also we get false. So, I removed 0 here. So, we are telling the first digit should be either 6, 7, 8 or 9. We have 9. Okay. After that, we should have 9 digits. But how many digits we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, right? We have only 8 digits. We should have 9 digits. So, we get false here. File, save, go to browser and refresh. We get false. So, this is a simple regular expression for validating the Indian phone number. I hope you guys have clearly understood. I strongly suggest you people to watch the previous video tutorials also. If you like this video, hit the like button and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited. In the upcoming video tutorials, we are going to discuss more about regular expressions. For more benefits and be up to date, do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.